Hello everyone, welcome back to a new episode of Crash Bandicoot 4. It's about time. Last time we left off, we met Tana and did two of her levels. And uh, now I guess we're going to go ahead and do the boss fight of this area, I suppose. I haven't actually went back in any of the prior levels yet because I'm still recording this the same day as the last one. But uh, yep, yeah, let's go. Jetboard Jelly. Ooh, okay, so... This lot... Is that a... Is that the time trial icon, or is that a tape icon? Oh, yeah, okay, so that's a tape icon. So that's how you know there's a tape in the level. And then we have to beat a certain time in each level to get the onks. I don't know about getting all the onks, I'm going to be honest. I don't know about getting all the onks. Uh, I'm, I'm bad at time trials. I am bad at time trials, <laughs> like really bad. Okay, well, let's go. Jetboard Jetty. So there is a tape in this one, so I'm not going to take a lot of risks if I can help it, because I'm probably not going to get all the crates anyway. I just want to make sure I get the tape. So we'll do that. We will do that. As soon as the game loads. I will probably stop talking about that eventually. <laughs> there we go. Boom. Uh, no, I don't want to skip it. Okay. Here we go. 196 in this level, jeez. So, I'll hit crates if they're near me just to get the wumpas, but, uh... Okay, I thought maybe I could get up there. But, uh, I'm not gonna go for any that are super dangerous. And jump. Alright. This little rat just hanging out on the anchor is pretty funny to me. I didn't think I was gonna make that for a second, I'm gonna be honest. Smash. I saw a thing hiding way up there, but I don't see it now. Weird. Let's just run right under- Whoa, you're throwing stuff at me. I don't appreciate that. Yeah, there was a crate hiding, like, up in some weird spot. Okay. I didn't mean to jump off of it. I accidentally pressed X twice. So, uh, that almost screwed me. Uh, boom, boom. Gotta make sure we get all the wumps out of this. There we are. And jump. And jump. And we're good. Smack. Anything in that treasure that I want? Nope. Alright, there wasn't one like higher up there. I don't think so. Alright, is this the jet board jetty? As it were? Oh boy, this controls weirdly oh boy it's so sensitive it is so sensitive oh man it's really sensitive okay okay this i don't like this i don't like this at all <laughs> okay well we got the tape at least so i guess i had, i have the privilege of doing another one of those uh today which yay <laughs> For a lot of death on my part. Alright, so... Boom. Uh... That works, right? Okay. And it looks like the TNT destroying that does count. I guess we'll see when we get to the end over here. Boom. 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 Ow. I don't know what I was doing there. Okay, that was stupid. Get back in there. We're getting this secret, damn it. I've gotten all the other secrets, bonus levels, things. Of course, I'm not really sure there's a point in me doing them. Well, I, I would want to... I want to beat all the secrets on screen, too. Even if I'm not going to be getting 100 crates now. I do still want to do the secrets. Okay, we did that. Boom. Boom. Okay. I screwed that up. It looks like that's probably about the end, though. Like, there might be one little... one more little area, but... Not too bad. Alright, Coco. Let's go! Okay, boom, boom, boom. There we go. I should probably just hang out on the TNT crate a bit longer... ...at, uh, that part that I just keep dying at. Probably the best thing to do. We can be like this, and then we can jump over here and do this. There we go. 
See, not too bad at all. Yeah, so TNT blowing them up definitely counts because we just got 29 out of 29 there. Okay. Cool. Got our first gym already. Thank you kindly. And let's go under here. And smack. And boom. Oh, I didn't even see this under me, really. I'm going to be honest. Oh, I thought that thing was going to fall on me, so I tried to run really quickly through it. But yeah, no, those don't fall. Smack. Smack. Well, this is an interesting level, at least. I will give it that. Very, uh, different. Uh, okay, ow. <laughs> Made that same mistake again, jeez. They got a lot of, uh, different things going on in this particular level. Oh, that's what it wants me to get there. There's some hidden wumpas hiding up there. Alright, boom. And you, we slide, slide. Okay, <laughs> almost screwed that up. Uh, jump, jump. Goodbye, friend. Uh, okay. No, no, slide. Okay, I have to get you. Actually, have to have to actually press a direction there to get it to do it. Okay, we're good. Aku Aku saved me there. Ah, I missed that crate. Damn it. Okay, was that a Kraken just hanging out over there? Excuse me? Was that just the Kraken himself? Oh no, it's just some kind of big fish. Well, that's even more terrifying. Please don't do that. I don't like Subnautica. It, well, I, I love Subnautica. It's a fantastic game, but it also terrifies the hell out of me, so... There's that. Oh. Okay, let's hit the... Yeah, let's just hit these to make sure we uh, actually destroy them. Okay, we did it. Is there anything else hiding over here? Aha, hidden gem. I thought I saw something hiding. Over there. Oh, that probably... No? Okay. Okay, Murray, get out of here. Oh, jeez, not this stupid thing again. Okay. Okay, I don't have to boost if I don't want to. Okay, that's that's the problem I was making. I didn't I didn't realize I could not boost. Like I thought I had to boost to actually move forward, but no. That is not the case. So this is much easier to control now, but when you boost, it's like uh Boogie Daba. Thank you, Raz. I appreciate the help. Alright. Here we go. Oh, I see you fishies. You wanna eat. Uh, that might have been bad. No, okay, we're good. Alright, well, what do you want me to get? Okay, there's nothing else hiding up there. There we go. Whoops. I mean, I meant to do that. I wanted to showcase what happens if you die in the water like that. That's, that's exactly what my plan was. Yes. Anyone who says otherwise is lying. All right. Boom. Boom. Got it. Got it. Okay. Uh, there we go. Did that. Boba da ba. Uh, how dare you. I just got him. He just decided to help me out. He's like, you know what? Now's a good time to help Coco out. And then he just immediately dies. Oh, Jesus. I'm sorry. I wanted that crate. Damn you. They sure do like just saying gibberish whenever you get them, these masks. But it could be another language. So maybe I'm being insensitive. I'm saying gibberish, but no, it's probably just their language, in fact. Okay, get out of the way, rat on anchor. Aha! I evaded you. He just feed himself a fish after throwing that? He's like, oh, I did a good job there. I'm a great minion. Time to eat. No, you don't. I was very close to falling off there, I want to point out. 
Goodbye. Goodbye to you, too. Alright, let's make sure we get all the Wumpa fruit out of this. Oh, Jesus. Uh, I was still spinning when I uh, pressed triangle there. So, uh, that caused some difficulties it did. Damn it! They actually hit me! No! I was doing so well. You jerks. Uh, okay, we're good. We are good. Let's just do all of this again. If I die again, I will cut this out. Because, yeah. Taking quite a bit, this part. Not doing awful, though, I like to think. Besides the, you know, dying a bunch, but... I feel like that's kind of comes with the territory with Crash. Okay, boom, and boom, and... No, you don't, you jerks. I've been through this enough now. I won't die again. I'll say it now. I'm not dying again. I'm too experienced now for that. Hear me. I refuse to die. Cue me dying. Very soon. Okay, well that... That will do it. Now I don't have my Aku Aku. Okay. I just have to dodge these guys. Jerks. Okay, the checkpoint's right there. Good. I wanna make sure I can hear that box blow up. <clears throat> I'm not sure how it works if you like... Like how far back in the level they despawn things. I'd be scared that like it would despawn the TNT that I jumped on. Okay, here we go. Haha, I led you into a mine. Okay, let's stop moving forward. Okay, now let's continue moving forward. Uh, uh. Okay, we're good. We're good. Wasn't scared at all. Okay. Uh, friends, please. You're trying to kill me. I know that's your job, but you're also trying to kill yourselves. And that's just not healthy. Please don't do that. Seek help. Everyone has a right to live. Oh, cool. I did a trick off of it. Ooh. Uh, screw you guys. Oh, no. Okay. Okay, we're good. We're good. Uh. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're absolutely fine. Nothing bad happened. I wasn't scared. 174 out of 196. Is that really just all... Oh, we gotta, like... Oh, you're like a weird anglerfish thing. You're like the thing from, uh... Uh, Psychonauts. That's what she remind me of. Oh. Oh, I probably gotta get those guys that come out to, um... Hit his tentacles? Or, well, it's... Their name is Louise, so maybe it's a she. Hi, Louise. How are you? Okay, no, you're not hitting me with that. I am, however, gonna lead this idiot right into your tentacle. Did that not hurt you? I was thinking that was what I needed to do, but maybe not? Okay, no, that is what I need to do. Cool. See, now the problem is, though, I got two of you to worry about. Oh, jeez. There we go. Super easy. Louise, you need to up your game. No, you don't. Okay, now we just gotta actually lead you guys into it. There we go. Goodbye, Louise. You see, you could've just left and not died. But instead, you wanted to stay and harass me. Please. Wow, I wasn't even close. I thought I did better than that on crates. But I guess I did miss that one at the very beginning. Trophy Aaron, silent protagonist. All right, we got the hidden, we got those, we got the flashback tape, and we unlocked the time trial. Continue. <laughs> oh, cool. There's the mask. Kano, old dark matter himself. A careful crash. He's heavier than me. <laughs> oh, good. You're awake. <sighs> All right. Two masks down, two to go. Feeling a little less panicked. I, I was at a 10 before, now I'm at a solid, let's say, 9.78. Oh yeah, these bandicoots are here to help. 
Bandicoot. Mm, follow. Short and to the point. Love this guy. <laughs> Bandicoot, follow. What a good, what a, what a good boy, Akano. I also love, uh, what's his face? I've forgotten his name, but Raz is voice actor. He's so good. And his writing's pretty fantastic. So I guess Louise was just the boss who had the fight there. Ooh! Early Japan. I like it. Um, I've, I've done a lot of, uh, that's it. So I double majored in college in, in Asian history and, um, uh, computer science. Uh, computer science was my main major, but my, uh, this is for me major was Asian history. And, uh, yeah, so I always love to visit areas and levels like this. Beat level to unlock- okay, so there is a tape here. Alright, we have enough time to do another level for sure. So. We're gonna go ahead and hop in and do ourselves another level. Uh, give it to a spin. I will. I will indeed give it a spin. Oh, wait, I forgot. I, I got another flashback tape. I said I was going to do that this episode, didn't I? Oops. Um. 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 Hmm. I guess we could just exit this level and go do the flashback tape. But I, I feel like I've already hopped in this level now. It'd feel weird to just leave it. We'll do the flashback tape next time. Hey, Crash. Oh, no. So where's the next mask? Not here. If these chuckle nuts weren't punching holes in reality, we could open our own rifts. Uh, for now, we're stuck taking the long route. But I sense another rift around here somewhere. Ah! Friends, I have a fun little game for you to play. I've got a reward for the clever bandicoots who can reach my testing grounds. But you'll have to defeat my deadly diabolical creations along the way. <laughs> All right, embryo. Whatever, man. Ooh, what, so what sort of power do you give us? R2 or triangle dark matter spin? Whoa! Oh, we can keep it going, too. Okay. Well, that is interesting. I like how they're giving us, like, new abilities and stuff like that. It makes it pretty neat. So let's just spin out of control. Why don't we? Wow, you can even kind of float with this. Interesting. I imagine we gotta be really careful with it at some points, though. Okay, that, that didn't quite work. Whoops. I thought it was gonna work, it didn't. Spoiler. Uh, yep. Give me that. Book it a bar. Boom, 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 boom. Maybe getting all the crates on this level will be pretty easy. Possibly. We're just like a dark helicopter now. Look at us. An evil helicopter. Boom, boom! We made it. Dark matter spin, yeah. Then double jump. And that gets us across that gap. Ooh. Okay, okay. We probably don't want a dark matter spin here. Right? Oh, it's been a while. What's been up to? Oh, me, mostly the same. Mixing potions, brewing potions, drinking potions. Testing potions. Wasn't there something back this way? Or am I crazy? I could have sworn I saw something over there. No, like over here. Like up above me or something? I might be wrong though. Okay, so I imagine I gotta do one of these to get over here. Yep, and there's our hidden gem for the level. Those aren't super bad to find. Ow. Ow. A boogadabah. A boogadabah. Well, we gotta do this again, I suppose, but it's not it's not gonna take that long. Okay. So jump there. Nope, I didn't want to do that. I wanted to land over here actually. Goodbye. 
And boom, boom. Get all of you. Okay, up here. There we go. We got a good amount of Wumpus there. Okay, the camera was being rude there. Oh, yeah, we missed the flashback tape. I forgot about that. Oh, well. We, we can come back and get it. Oh, these things want to eat us. Okay. This dimension was quite peaceful when I arrived. Unfortunately, my potions had some murderous effects on the inhabitants. Uh, all the better to test you with. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, we get it, Embryo. You love testing and stuff. He's the one that jacks himself up with potions <clears throat> for his boss fight in the other games. If I remember correctly. He just drinks a bunch and hulks out. Okay. Uh, hi. Interesting. A boogadaba. Dark spin deflects green magic. What does that mean? Okay. Green magic, huh? So dark beats green. Got it. Is there anything over here? No? Come on, there's gotta be something hiding here, right? Aha! There was. There we go. You're not gonna fall, Coco. Oh, okay. Cool. I'm glad I didn't Dark Matter spin before I fell down that. Oh, jeez. Okay. Um. Okay. Where's my thing that fills these in? I haven't seen it anywhere. That's what I've always Where is it? So dedicated to science. Not like the natives here are willing to cooperate with even a simple deadly test. Hmm. Yeah, I'm not seeing what uh I would activate those with. Well, I destroyed that thing. I'm not sure if that's important or not. Huh. Yeah, I mean it must be around here somewhere, but I'm just I'm not seeing it. Maybe we gotta go all the way over here. That would be pretty insane, but could be. Uh, uh. That was close. Alright, let's blow you guys up, I suppose. Goodbye. I must go home to my people. Uh, uh. Okay, we're good. And boom. Got it. Alright, you guys are weird. I don't like you guys. No, you don't. There we go. I wish I didn't have to resort to live tests for my experiments, but you know, harmless eggs, superpowered potions, marsupia, I mean, other animals. <laughs> Ow. Okay, wasn't expecting that. That just kind of came out of nowhere really quickly and just bopped me. I was listening to Embryo and I was like, all right, I guess we can go ahead and advance. And no, no, you can't. Blow that up. Goodbye. I must return to my people. I just love flying super high in the air. This is a neat power. I really like this one. All right. Boom, boom. Okay, I was about to say, please come back up in time. <laughs> Otherwise, I'm gonna die. Smack. No, you don't. I'm prepared this time. Uh, yeah, that thing's still shooting me, though, so I should be careful. All right, the secret. What you got for me? Um. Hmm. Interesting. Okay. Do I have to like get all the way to the end and yeah, hit this? Okay, yeah, I thought that's what, maybe what I needed to do. There we go. So now we've hit those. 
I can get back over there. We should be able to get up there, maybe? Hmm. I guess the sill doesn't super solve my problem, does it? I think I screwed it up. I think I just screwed up the map. Yeah, I think that's... Yep, yeah, I think I screwed it up. Let's just jump off. I think I was supposed to save something earlier. Uh, so, like, one of the uh, bouncy blocks or something. Like, maybe I'm not supposed to hit the TNT because it blows up something I need. Alright, come on. What do we got? Uh, no, you don't blow up anything I need. You're also... This is also the only way I can get by. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, I'm not super seeing... What, uh... I need to be doing here. Weird. Maybe I could do it before, but I was just not seeing the solution? Well, it would help if I didn't miss that crate. Alright, give me a few seconds. I'm going to investigate this a bit and see if I can come up with a solution to this particular problem. Okay, I managed to get up here by doing that. And I think this should work? Yeah, okay. That works. Now I just gotta activate that. Oh, but wait, I can't... I can't get back up there. Hmm. Well, I thought that would be the solution, but... No, apparently there's something else that I'm just missing here. <laughs> because, yeah, I can't get back up there to smack that one. Especially since I've gotten rid of this bouncy one over here. Okay, well, off the pit you go. Alright, uh, I'm going to be honest. I have no idea how to do this one. Like, you have to ground pound these crates to get rid of them. These ones on top here with, like, the metal reinforced. But that also destroys the bouncy crate you need down there. I'm totally stumped on this one. I don't... I don't know how to do it. I, I thought I had a couple of ideas. But... I, I can't think of anything. Like, I can get everything but this one over here. After we press the button. And I've tried multiple things to see if I could get over there. Um. To, uh, like, hit it. Without the bouncy block over there, the wooden crate one. Like, I tried slide jumping off of here and jumping over there, but I just can't quite make it. So, yeah. I, I don't know what I'm supposed to do here. I'll uh, have to come back to it at some point, but yeah, for now I'm just going to leave it. It's fine. So that's that, I suppose. Yeah, that's unfortunate. I just, I, I did not know what was going on with that one. Like at all. My brain was just not functioning for that particular puzzle, I guess. All right, we're good. Oh, jeez. That's not fun. Please quit that. Okay, we're just gonna do that. And get out of there. Go away. Okay, we blew that up. Cool. I really like... Uh, shit. I really do like this uh, power that we get here, though. It's really cool, and it's fun to use. I quite enjoy it. Okay, yeah, we get it. Let me just jump on that, and I'm out of your hair. Okay? Oh, jeez, I bounced off. I bounced off! I thought it would kill him. I thought it would kill him, but I bounced off instead. <laughs> I was under the impression that if I ran into him uh, during while using this ability that they just died because they were green. But uh, that does not appear to be the case. Go away! Okay, there we go. Nothing hiding up there. Jump. Okay, we made it. Boom, boom. Okay, and away we go. I don't care that I missed that. I'm not getting all crates anyway. I'm just trying to live. No, you don't. You will not be eating today. Bandicoot is not on the menu. Wow, I got really close to getting all crates, actually. 
considering I just started saying screw it at some point. Yeah, do your little dance, Coco. Alright, time trial unlocked. We can continue. But uh, yeah, I think we're gonna go ahead and end this episode off. I was sitting there on that bonus level for quite a while trying to figure out what the hell was going on there, but... I could not get it, so... I hope you've enjoyed this episode of Crash Bandicoot 4. It is about time. And uh, I'll see you next time. <laughs>